Fishing can be deemed a risky operation. Being knowledgeable on how to navigate your way to safety is of paramount importance. For this purpose, the Fishing Captain Training Program was implemented by the Windward Island Research and Education Foundation, Windruff, at St. George's University, in collaboration with the Ministry responsible for fisheries. The program is part of a large project entitled Climate Change Adaptation of the Eastern Caribbean Fisheries Sector Project, CC4 Fish, which is funded by Global Environment Facility through the Food and Agricultural Organization of the United Nations. The captains were all presented their captain's permit, a VHF radio with GPS and AIS. Howard Mitchell is one of the captains who had completed the training. On board his fishing vessel, he explained how the equipment will enhance his safety at sea. I'm thankful for the radio because in case my, one of my GPS fail, I have a, a backup on the VHF which I know that one will not really fail me. And um, the other second thing is the, the GPS, uh, Nadia, the AIS. It's very useful because if my other AIS system fails as well, I have a second backup, which is on the VHF radio, which the course have been giving to us and which is very important. And the second, the third thing is the distress signal on that radio, that red button on the corner there. You lift it up and then you press it and you hear an alarm so everybody know exactly. So if you have the same radio, you will exactly get my position exactly where I is. Ronald Baldio has been one of the facilitators of the program. I mean, the training was very successful. Over um, from the 301 fishers that were trained, only five persons were lit for any session at all during the course, and that was really good for the guys. And they showed a lot of interest, and they very appreciated of the training, and you know, and expressed um, how it would help them in the fishing operations. The captains were trained in a number of areas, some of which include rules of the road, coastal navigation, seamanship and boat handling, safety at sea, search and rescue, VHF radio operating procedures, using VHF radio and GPS, and FM radio. Christina John, GBN News.